it's Brian Devine. Thanks so much for joining me again today. I want us to have another conversation about video because this is a question that has come up with, uh, with my clients a few times now, which is how do I make sure that any video that I'm doing makes me money? And I think that really is the ultimate question because there's a lot that you can do with video, but how do you make sure that when you spend the time, energy, and effort on video, how do you monetize it? How do you make sure that there's a return on investment? Well, there's a lot of ways to do that. So let's just look at one way, which is to generate traffic to your website. Now, if you've got a video camera and you're, it's sitting in your office right now, you've got one heck of a tool to drive people to your website. So start thinking about things that you can video um, whether it's yourself, whether it's staff, whether it's uh, uh, people that are already in your practice, your patients, and think about ways that you can do some really quick, short videos. Obviously, you want to get permission from anybody and everybody that is on that video that it's okay to use it as a marketing tool. And then what you do is you put the video on your website. Okay, so you want to host it on your website so that you have control over what happens when somebody watches that video meaning when they watch it and it's over they stay on your website now if you put it on YouTube which I do recommend that you do you don't necessarily want to use the code that YouTube gives you and paste it back into your website so that YouTube is streaming the video to your site because what happens is when the video is done now it has played on your site but when it's done now YouTube will automatically start showing other videos for them to watch that you don't have control over that are not based on what you want them to do next so you might lose their attention and then they go to some other website so it's a good idea to always put your your video on your site first and then make a list of a bunch of other video sharing sites like YouTube uh, Google Video, Yahoo Video Veho, Metacafe, there's a ton of them. And get your video onto those sites. And make sure that you've thought through the keywords that you're going to put under that video. So when you upload these videos to these websites, you get to decide what you want to tag them with. And just tagging them basically means that you're going to choose keywords to uh, have people find that video with. So if you've got some basic keywords that you're going to focus on and you always put those around your videos and you put them all over the internet and on your website, you're going to generate a lot of traffic, a lot of what we call backlinks back to your website and it's going to move you up in the search engine rankings. It gives you the possibility of taking up two or three spots on Google's first page for those keywords that you focused on. It's a really great tool. So consider what you can do with that video camera that maybe it's uh, been uh, sitting in, the, uh, in your office and you just don't know what to do with it. There's a lot that can be done. So get it out, dust it off, and start making some videos. Use it to generate traffic. It's a great way to do it. It. If you have any more questions, if you have uh, want to know more specifics about how to make that happen, let me know. I look forward to the continued conversation. Bye for now.